And again tonight, that pilot remains here at the hospital and recovering. We want to turn our attention now to the crash itself. It still remains under investigation, and it'll likely be quite some time before we know exactly what went wrong to bring that helicopter down. We want to go live now to Channel 2's Roseanne Aragon, who has more on the moments just before that crash. Roseanne? That's right, Jonathan. You can see this is an area where many people live. In fact, I saw children watching from a nearby window. They were watching this. This is now the cleanup of that crash site. The helicopter landed right here at the leasing office just by the pool. Residents say they feel for the officer's family and are also thankful no one else was hurt. This is the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. A helicopter crash around 2 a.m. Saturday here at the Biscayne at City View apartment complex on Imperial Valley. Resident Daryl Rollins couldn't believe his eyes. It was so much going on because, like, the only thing I know is I'm looking at him at the top of the sky. And all of a sudden you hear a noise and, like, he just falling. Chief Art Acevedo said two officers were in the 75 Fox helicopter from the Houston Police Department's Air Operations Unit and were investigating reports of bodies floating in a bayou. Some residents heard the helicopter and knew something went very wrong. Turning off a uh, propel. Like, doo -doo 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 and then the boom. Crime scene units nearby let police know their helicopter was down. It crashed just feet away from where many people call home. Some people was sleeping right there or something like that. It, you know, fortunately it was on the listen center office. Houston Fire and police responded. The officer pilot and technical flight officer were trapped inside and had to be cut out and rushed to the hospital. A tragic start to our day. These were two, uh, two uh, outstanding police officers. Uh, one is still in the hospital getting the best medical treatment that you can imagine. Beloved officer Jason Knox lost his life. Their helicopter injured no one else. Now residents say they are lucky, but their hearts are with the officers and their loved ones. I feel for the family. I, f I do. Houston police are investigating this crash as a homicide leaving no stone unturned. The NTSB and FAA are also doing an extensive investigation. You can see here there's plenty of work left to be done. Reporting live from Greens Point, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC Channel 2 News. Jonathan, back to you. All right, Roseanne, thanks a lot for that. Keep